Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Let's Play Warcraft with Zorondin, episode 13. And I have just arrived here in Terran this? Mill. So I'm going to run around and grab all the quests. Uh, looks like I do have to go into this building. Uh, show off my mount for today before I run in there. I'm going to be using the goat here, the black riding goat. And uh, I, I forgot who that comes from. I will double check that here in a little bit for you, just to uh, not to disappoint, I suppose. Um, in the meantime, I am running around grabbing some quests, as I said that, and I forgot my mini pet. What would you ask? Uh, no, I didn't. It's right there. I don't know if I've used him or not already, already or not, but I'm going to use him anyways today. It's Frosty, the Lich King collector's mount, or pet. Actually, I have used him. I'm going to use the Guardian Cub then. That Guardian Cub you can buy on the Blizzard store. Uh, I believe it's 15 No, it's not. It's $10. And uh, you can also buy it off the auction house from somebody else that bought it, as I did. Uh, because once you've bought it, it sits in your inventory for a day and then becomes unsoulbound. And you can choose to sell it. Obviously, if you learn it, uh, it goes away. So... You do have to not learn it to be able to sell it. So that's how I got my Guardian Cub. We'll go ahead and use him today. I believe there's a mount equivalent of him as well. The Eternal Sun guides All right, us. we got a bunch of quests here. And let's see where we can go. It looks like we want to go over here to the east. So that's where we'll head. And uh, while I am running, I am going to try and find out where you get the Black Riding Goat. As I run into a post here. That's lovely. There we go. All right, Reigns of the Black Riding Goat. The Tiller's Exalted. That makes sense. Uh, so the farming reputation guys in the Valley of the Four Winds. Get them to Exalted, and you can buy several different types of goats. It's a pretty cool mount. Um, I don't use it much myself, but I do like the pack of supplies on the back of it. That's pretty unique and uh, interesting to check out. So, hey, kind of fun, kind of cool. Uh, where is this first quest objective? Hill Fawn saved. Um, oh, there's something like that going on. Uh, here we go. Um, I was hoping to go and quest in um, Arathi Highlands. Not Arathi Highlands. The Hinterlands. Um, unfortunately, I am just too low for it at the moment. I'm going to try probably at level 28 to see if we can do it then. Uh, so the goal is still to get there simply because it is a high level zone. I want to I want to get to that zone like as soon as possible and try and have a, a bit of a challenge going on. So for now we're gonna make up time by uh, or take up time by killing off some of these guys here and. Uh, doing some quests here. Uh, ooh, there's a big uh, elite, or not a, well, he is an elite. He's a big Yetimus, Yetimus, the uh, Yeti Lord. I think somebody's fighting him, and I'm gonna guess because he's an elite, I can help. So I'm actually gonna get over there pretty quick and help out there. Uh, there might go in that cave too, there might be some iron in there. Classically, there always has been, so might as well go for it. Here we go, gonna get in on this. I don't know if that guy is uh, faction based. I also don't know why my uh, thing is way over there. He is a horde. Okay. Sometimes you can't tell with those dang pandas. You gotta actually look at them. Hopefully I get credit for this. I did not. Oh, that's unfortunate. Alright. Moving on. Take out this guy really quick. And we'll keep an eye out for the Edemus respawning so we can take him out. Uh, one thing... Oh, wait. Do I have to wand these guys or something? Oh, interesting. Looks like I got a bit of a graphical air going on there. Those guys are in full black. Oh, well. Uh, it happens occasionally. Take out these guys here. I am going to actually try and fix this x pearl thing. It's bothering me. I don't know why it suddenly changed like that. Actually, I don't know what that is. I think that might be Pet's target. It's Pearl. No, that's my target. It should be right there. One hunter, save. 
All right, hopefully that's fixed. We'll go start playing with the Yetis here. Should be able to get this one done. Oh, Yenimus is up already. Nice. Go and engage him. I should be able to get him pretty easily. I mean, I am his level after all. Here we go. Actually, somebody might have gone in the cave, unfortunately. All right. Take a Troll's Blood Elixir and go for it. Whoa. Oh, my. That was, uh, that was interesting. <laughs> get, uh, actually use all my abilities here for once. Oh, I don't have Growl turned on. I turned Growl off for the instance, and uh, I'm kind of paying for that now. Where is my... Oh my gosh, why is my Ravager all the way over there? I don't have him on, like, stay or anything, do I? Oh, he's fighting another mob. That's always good. Where's that other one? Oh my gosh. This guy's more annoying than difficult. Oh good, now my pet's dead. I'm actually not going to be able to do this guy very easily. Start popping potions, I guess. Nope, I got a full-on run. Holy crap. Why is this guy so hard? Wow. They, you know, Blizzard comes out and says, Well, we removed all the group quests from the game, and you're not going to have to do those. And then you go and do a quest, and you can't do it? I mean, did I miss something here? No, suggested players three. What the heck? Ah, uh, Whatever. I like group quests, I like that they exist, but when Blizzard claims they're not in existence anymore and you find them, uh, that's kind of interesting. I think if I had gotten a clean pull with my pet, I probably could have done that. He's not too uh, difficult with a pet. Uh, so, if I can get my pet up and get in the right position where I won't have any ads, I am going to try that again. Uh, oh, that's a lot of horses. I always forget about the wild horses here. Uh, but for now, uh, is my pet dead? He, yes, yes. Your pet is dead. Not very big letters there. Do I need to do anything with the stalkers? No stalkers. So we'll just get to work here. Um, I'm also hoping uh, to get a, a couple episodes of Warcraft information out this week on 5.2. Uh, I will keep you guys updated on that. Uh, again, I may not get it in time, but I'm going to try. Uh, I do have the client, the trial test server PTR. There you go. I have the PTR client installed now, so I'm going to try and do that this week. Also, guys, if you're any of my StarCraft guys, you can check out uh, StarCraft information. I released three episodes of that last Friday. That is a new series that I'm going to be doing every once in a while when there is updates on StarCraft. So that should be pretty cool. Um, I'm I'm liking it. Uh, I've always liked my information series on Warcraft and why not do one in StarCraft? It does make sense. Uh, there will probably be less episodes of StarCraft information simply because new stuff doesn't seem to come out as often for StarCraft. But I will try and get you guys updated when major content patches, not content patches, but uh, Major, like, balance patches and stuff come out. Things like that uh, that need to be reported. So keep an eye out for that. Check out what I did last Friday. It should be uh, pretty cool. Little tidbits of information for you if you're playing StarCraft at all that you might find worthwhile. Um, also, you guys may notice that there is only one Let's Play today. Uh, that is, of course, because I only did one last week, and I just decided to take a little bit of a break from it. Uh, but as of Wednesday, I should be back to two uh, per time. So, go back here. I'm going to pop this last troll's blood. Growl being on. Let's get to work. Let's see if we can do this. Have my pet do his abilities and get a serpent sting in there. Ooh, I don't have very much uh, focus, unfortunately. Pet's getting walloped. Can I heal him? I have heal, right? Oh, it's not. It's a dot. Crap. Should have done it earlier. I'm already going to have to run, I think. And, oh, I didn't aggro the ad, at least. Oh, but now I did. Good. Now I'm going to die again. Lovely. I'm not going to be able to solo this. I'm just going to leave this quest alone. I'm probably going to die here, but uh, might as well pop a potion and try to survive. Did I oh, my gosh. I de-aggroed. Heck, yes. All right. Less deaths. Always a bonus. Can I... Mount up here and get in this cave. And 
Yeah, I'll be able to get around him, no problem. He's far out of the way. I wish I could have gotten in on that first kill with that other panda. Unfortunately, such is not the case today. I feel like I've done that guy before solo, but now that I think about it, I was probably on my level 90 character just flying around here catching pets or something. I was like, oh, a giant yeti, I should kill him. So, not the case of today, I guess. Uh, double tin back there. I was hoping for iron. There's another one. No, tin as well, unfortunately. Might as well go mine them, though. I can use the uh, mining skill ups, and if it comes down to it, I can sell the tin. More tin. Jeez, quite a bit of tin in here. Looks like there's one up here, maybe. Not healing very quick. I guess I'm not staying out of combat. I will use my fancy silk bandages. I have gotten quite a bit of cloth out of my guild bank here, who is now 20, level 25, by the way. Uh, so that has been pretty helpful in getting all of that. Use some multi-shot here, maybe, if I can target him. There we go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Getting angry. Use my uh, dynamite. I always forget about dynamite. Ba-boom. Didn't do too much. All right. In their hearts slowly. I thought it was just kill them. I wasn't even paying attention to what the quest was. Goodness, there are a ton of veins in here. Wait, what was that? Oh, that that's my pet. Weak. All right, we'll mine up that one. We'll mine up that one. I'm actually going to have quite a bit of tin here. All right. Get that one. Might as well go get the one behind me. Is there going to be some aggro here? Where is this one? Oh, shoot. It's upstairs. All right. We will go take out this guy then and get at this other tin. Uh, I think I'm going to push to 27. I was thinking pushing, uh, going to check the Hinterlands at 26, but I would probably stop the episode at that point, and I don't really want to do that. So I think I'm going to push 27, and then I'll go check. I'm guessing it's going to unlock at 28, uh, but who knows. So 27 will be the checking level, so I will stop the video at 27. Uh, if I get to 27, hopefully I will. I may not, though. Who knows? I do have at least some rested bonus. I'm not sure how high it is. Um, what is that? A helmet? Okay. <laughs> I guess we're looking for some helmets and swords and stuff for somebody. That's cool. All right, let's get out of this cave. I think we are done with yetis. Another Scarlet Halls is unlocked. Uh, the Scarlet Monastery wing. I think that's the first wing. Yeah, it's got to be at level 26. Let's check that out. Oh, yeah, that's going to be the first wing. All right, take this guy out. Might as well grab this other tin, I guess, too. Why not? Why not? There we go. I always used to open up with Concussive Shot. I need to get back in the habit of that. Slowing that enemy down before he gets to you. Of course, my pet normally tanks it, so it's not a huge issue either. Alright, one last tin. I'm not going to bother with that other one up here, simply because I'd have to go through three unnecessary mobs to get it. So, let's get out of the cave here. Oh my gosh. Somebody fighting that on my faction? Please, please. Oh, where'd, where'd she go? Horde, let's invite her. Mm, please accept. Can I accept? You got a fishing pole. I might want to leave. <laughs> uh, not accept. Cannot find player. What? Invite. Now accept, please. Please? No? If you're playing and someone invites you to kill a mob with them, accept the invite. She might be training him, but that's stupid. Wait, just accept the invite. Huh, whatever. Do what you gotta do, I guess. Moving on, I'll do my own thing. Oh my gosh, kitties everywhere. Kitties, kitties, kitties everywhere. Alright, we are done with that meat. I don't know what she's doing. Annoying people. Um, I'm gonna mine this tin again for another skill up. I think I'm gonna stop mining tin uh, Just because it seems like that's all I'm doing this video. So We will leave that alone and, uh, What do we need to do here now? 
Yenimus, sword and pants. It looks like it's somewhere over here. I'm gonna go check for that. Do -do -do. Avoid Yetimus here as the jerkwad Taran keeps moon firing back and forth and renewing herself for some reason. Um, says uh, I bet it is in the cave where that tin is. I might end up mining that tin after all. I'm gonna go over here. Oh, maybe I don't have to clear anything. There we go. There's that item. And uh, if this lady doesn't go for the tin, I will. Do do do. Um, level 25. I might as well help her kill it and see if she minds it. Yes, free tin for me. All right, mine that up. And I'm gonna guess the pants are in this other wing here. So we're gonna do that. And uh, my pet will bring a few friends probably. Where is he? Where? Where is my Ravenger? Oh my gosh, I don't know where my Ravenger is at. There he is, what the heck? Ah, oh, he did bring a friend. Oh well. Take this guy down. There we go. And I'm gonna guess the pants are up here. Start mowing our way there. Map say any help? Not really. Just says it's in the cave. I wish the little caves had maps. Uh, unfortunately. <laughs> That's never been anything Blizzard's ever thought about doing. Uh, so you just have the big overhead map. I gotta say though, instance maps were more important than little cave maps, so I'm glad they did instance maps. Trying to do instances back in the day when they were big mazy puzzles and you didn't have a map, oh my gosh. I got lost in uh, the Sunken Temple so many times. I, I'm pretty sure every single time I went to Sunken Temple, I got lost. That place is still a beast. It is still confusing. Talk about one of the instances that you do not want Blizzard to make into a heroic in an expansion. Woof. I think the next one they need to do is Scrapple, and that just seems obvious. Get a uh, new Baron runs and whatnot. And uh, make it two wings, you know? Give us a Baron Geddon run and a uh, Living run. You know, the Scarlet Crusade over there. Of course, with a lot of the lore changes, I don't know if they do that stuff, but... Well, not lore changes, but lore updates. I gotta mine the tin, guys. I'm right next to it. I'm not gonna leave it there. Now, look at that. I got a moonstone. Totally worth it. Alright. I... Oh, 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 oh. Thought this ramp would still be clear. I need to go save some more fawns, and then we're gonna head back to our tar and mill and turn these in, see how much XP we get. Hopefully hit 27 so I can call the episode. We will see. Quickly. And what do we got? Three more in the way. Sometimes I wish I had stealth. I think uh, hunters get that ability at what? 85? 90? No, it's gotta be 85, right? I don't even know what it's called. I'm gonna try and find it here. I suppose I should go deeper into the levels. There we go. Stampede. Camouflage. Level 85. That would be nice at lower levels, but I get it. We're not rogues. I'm not going to cheat the entire game out like that. That would be kind of lame. All right. There we go. Outside. That is one thing you can always uh, use to your advantage with caves is that caves do end before their graphics typically end. Uh, once you're outside, of course, you can mount up right away, which I was able to do and get away from these yetis here. So now I just need to find some more fawns. Uh, the territory seems to be more western than eastern here. But it does say there's some over here, so maybe I can get five over here. I don't know. Worth checking out. Ooh, a vendor. Excuse me. Check this guy out. All right, I'm going to take those. I'm not there yet in skill-wise, but I will use them later. That's all for now, though. Spin around here. I don't think there's going to be any fawns. However, there are some of the cats. Um. Oh, hey, kitty. Kitty wants a piece. Hey, there is at least one. 
Let's get him grown up. Move on from there. Uh, I'm gonna guess that's it, though. We're gonna spin back. Oh, there's a dead one. Jerk cat killed him. Oh, there's a uh, there's one there. There's two. Getting so close now. I know they're just gonna trickster tricks me into not being able to finish this, aren't they? Is uh, somebody fishing? Are they fighting? Yeah, they're fighting. That's weird. I don't know what's going on. Oh, it does say saved quotations. I'm probably corrupting them somehow. What a jerk. I'm such a jerk. All right, now. Oh, oh, what is that? That is silver. Awesome. Awesome. Sorry, guys. I'm mining again. But it's silver. I gotta mine it. Oh. I got a skill up, too. Look at that. This is not the mining show. I am uh, not just mining. I'm actually going to hit Terran Mill here since I'm here. Uh, let's see how much XP we get for all these quests. Just uh, take advantage of being over here already, I guess. I didn't plan on it, but such is the case. Got... Is it just three quests I have to turn in? That's disappointing. I thought I was up to like four or five, but I guess five is how many were totally over there. Alright, there is... The first one, turn into you, I have stag you. witches, mmm, delicious, turn into you, what do you require? any upgrades here, no, so we take the most expensive one, yes indeed, decent Beware. amount of XP as well, we might be very close here, or well, we will be very close here might just turn over and be 27 run through here very quickly where are you at oh a book what is it alliance of loiteron that's nice i'm not reading that I am forsaken. and turn that in just does he put his one. gear on oh i was hoping he'd put it on that's too bad all right so we're pretty close we're gonna go finish this fawn quest and see what that gives me and uh See uh, if we can call it there or not. Uh, if I kill a four, few more mobs out there, I might get there as well. Um, unfortunately, the rested bonus is almost run out there. Um, I think I was logged out in an inn. Um, yeah, I was in Undercity the whole time, so I did get double rested bonus. You know, the normal rate of an inn. So that's good. All right, a couple more fawns. What do we need? Two. There is one right there. Oh, and somebody else killed Yetimus again. It's great. And there's number 10. Turn that in. Now, does it say how much XP I'll get? About 3,000. And I need more than that. So, let's run over here and turn in this at the East Point Tower. See how much XP we get for that. And then I can actually take a flight path back to Taran Mill. Taran Mill? I think it's Taran Mill. Uh, it wouldn't make sense to have something named after the Taran on the Eastern Kingdoms. Now, would it? All right, I am going to actually go edit here just because this is going to be a bit of running. So I'll see you at the spot. All right, here I am. Uh, there's a little ramp right here. Get up here. Those are some nice chairs. Dang. Ah. Whatever. Uh, that was only 800 XP. So, still gonna be short about a thousand. What does this guy have? A couple quests. We're gonna grab them. Just to see. Oh, good. Another uh, group quest that I probably can't do. Um. Well. I'm supposed to kill some Albies, so I'm just gonna kill some Albies then. And, uh, should get me there pretty quickly. I'm not even gonna bother to complete this quest. I'm just gonna quit after I get about a thousand XP. Which, how much did that give me? 400? Oh. Just kill probably three of these guys then. There's a big bear! Ha! Huh. Alrighty then. Huh. Alright. Where we got? One more here. There's another one over there as well. Do I even need him though? Yeah, I should probably take him, because the quest is not going to give me over 3k, it's going to give me under 3k. And... 
Boom, that should do it. All right, I'm going to cut here. I will see you back in Terran Mill, where we will level up. And I have arrived back in Taran Mill. Yeah, Terran. Terran Mill. Yes, Terran Mill. Anyways, going to turn in the Fawn Quest, which is over here. I went in a complete giant circle. Uh, there we go. Talk to her. The dark Sh times will pass. What? Oh my gosh, I'm 50 XP short. Wait, no, I'm 750 short. Wait, what? No, I'm 50 XP short. Oh my gosh. All right, there's got to be a bear or something over here, or a cat, I guess. I can shoot in the face and level up. Can I kill a horse? I'm going to kill a stupid horse and level up. That should give me 50 XP, right? I can't say I've ever leveled off killing a horse. All right, level 27. Anyways, guys, that is going to do it for this episode. I'm going to empty out my inventory, run over to Hinterlands, check it, if we're good to go, we will quest there. If not, you will see me back in Terran Mill, where we will do more Hinterlands quests. So, that's going to do it. Uh, please do thumbs up and subscribe so I can bring you more World of Warcraft stuff. I have been Zrondin. Thanks for tuning in. I will catch you all on the other side.